Hello friends, welcome to civil engineering exam. Today we are going to see the problem related with wastewater engineering in the topic of trickling filter. So the question is, design a trickling filter with the following data. So the given is, the quantity of sewage is 4.5 million liters per day. So raw BOD is 400 ppm, effluent BOD is 50 ppm. Uh, then recirculation ratio that is R by A equal to 1.5 then BOD removed in primary clarifier is 30 percentage of total BOD then uh, depth of uh, tank is 1.8 meter so these are all the given values we have to find out the diameter of the trickling filter uh, so first uh, thing we have to find out the efficiency so the efficiency of trickling filter so the efficiency equal to incoming BOD minus outgoing BOD divided by incoming BOD so that is uh, uh, the total BOD removed uh, that will be calculated by using incoming BOD minus outgoing BOD divided by incoming BOD so now we have to find out the incoming BOD there is a uh, raw BOD is 400 and 30 percentage of BOD is removed from uh, primary sedimentation tank so that's why we are uh, putting uh, 400 minus 30 percent of 400 ppm so that is uh, the solving the equation we got uh, 280 ppm so incoming BOD is 280 p parts per million so next thing is outgoing BOD that is effluent BOD is 50 uh, ppm that is also given so now the efficiency equal to incoming BOD minus outgoing BOD divided by incoming BOD so incoming BOD is uh, 280 and outgoing BOD is 50 uh, so incoming minus outgoing divided by 280 into 100 so we got the value of 82.14 percentage so now uh, we know the formula neat as equal to that is efficiency equal to 100 divided by 1 plus 0 0 0.0044 root of y divided by v into f so the y is uh, bod and uh, f is equal to uh, we can calculate uh, using a uh, recirculation formula then v is equal to volume so from that we, uh, we find out the volume uh, we can uh, find out the diameter of the trickling filter so now the formula for f equal to uh, 1 plus r by i divided by 1 plus 0 0.1 r by i the whole square so the r by i is given 1.5 that is uh, that's also given so uh, 1 plus 1.5 divided by 1 plus 0 0.1 into 1 1.5 square so we got the value of 1.89 so the f value is 1.89 so now we have to find out the y values that is bod value so now y equal to net uh, incoming bod uh, bod 5 in kgs so uh, 280 uh, 280 is the incoming BOD so 280 divided by uh, we have to find out in grams so that's why we divide by 1000 into 1000 that is milligram in uh, milligram will convert it into 1000 into 1000 that is kg into 4.5 into 10 power 6 so uh, because uh, 4.5 into the million so 4.5 into 10 power 6 we got the value of uh, 1260 kg per day so that is a y value so we substitute all the values over the formula so neta equal to 82.14 equal to 100 divided by 1 plus 0 0.0 Zero four four root of y value is one two six zero and uh, v that is a uh, unknown and f value is we find out a one point eight nine. Solving this, we got the value of uh, V equal to 0 0.2729 into 10 power 4 meter cube. So, uh, 2729 meter cube. So, we find out the area. So, area is equal to volume divided by depth. So, depth is equal to given that is uh, 1.8 given. Uh, volume we find out uh, 2729 divided by 1.8. We got the value of 1516.11 meter square. So, that is the area of trickling filter. So after that we find out the diameter so pi by 4 into d square equal to 1516.11 so from that we find out the d value d is equal to 44 meters. So this is the method to solve the trickling filter problem again we will see in next video thank you.